a way to get you off my mind. Yeah. I used to be so tough. Never really gave enough. So do you understand about that? Like, can you explain to me? Yeah, sure, why not? Can, I, can you explain to me too? So we're going to show the application of the osmosis by using a snail. But we would never recommend killing an innocent creature like snail. The example of sorting a snail is too bizarre to receive. Once you understand what happens when you sort a snail, you will realize that salt is the snail's kryptonite and its terrible way to die. Fortunately for the snail, it has a shell to protect itself so that is why it will hide itself in the shell. This probably seems like a fatal flaw but surely no snail expects to have pure salt drop on it. But when such a thing does happen, the high concentration of the salt on the outside of the snail causes the cells to start trying to balance concentration. In non-scientific terms, the water will suck right out of the snail's body. The snail will try and die if enough salt is applied. Hmm. Membrane only allow the water to move through it. Doesn't allow the big particles such as fatty acid, ion, or folic acid. So minimum pressure needed to maintain the equilibrium, which we call as osmotic pressure. But osmosis is vital process in biological life. So we can show you on the application. to run an experiment about how diffusion may occur when we put salt on the snails. Throughout this experiment, we would know in more details the reaction between snails' membrane with salt, which high concentration of water in snails will diffuse towards salt. To run this experiment, we use set of apparatus and material. So let's have a look. The set of apparatus and material that we use is firstly, is dye. Why we use dye? Because 
we want to show clearly how the liquid diffuses from one medium to another. Next is tissue. Tissue represent as the snail's membrane. And lastly is a dropper. So guys, before we go on the test about the process that happened into the snail, we should visualize about what happening, the medium that will pass through the member of the snail. So this is my assistant. She will do the test about to visualize what will happen during the osmosis in the snail. So firstly, she will put or drop the dye onto the water. So you can see that the dye will spread all over the container. And uh, you can see it is deficient actually. Then the dye will high concentration of dye will move to the low concentration of dye at the other tissue. Therefore, it will continue moving until all the dye will co cover the low concentration. Uh, then, as the tissue act as the snail membrane, therefore, uh, the process uh, that happen is all the all the liquid in the snail will be hydrated. We have come to the end. Do you understand, okay? Yes, I am. So kiss. Don't, Don't kiss snails. snails.